the enormity of COVID means that trying to maintain people's morale, motivation, focus on doing the absolute best job that they can has been tough, particularly when people are committed, but they're scared. So it's been those real touch points with people which have been about alleviating loneliness, alleviating poverty, alleviating hunger. That's been done by teams within my immediate control, but it's also been done through partnership activities with the voluntary and community sector, different councils working together, the police and everything else. I don't think that a lot of people still have that privilege when they're a chief executive. And my privilege is that I can see the difference it makes to people at times. I was really afraid to take some leave because I didn't want to let people down that I work for. I didn't want to let my staff team down as well, but that's just not sustainable. There are some days where it doesn't go well, but I think that that happens anyway as a leader. You have those days where you just think that couldn't have gone worse. How am I going to make sure that that does not happen again? But overall, I'm really proud of myself and what's been achieved. And actually, I think that that is going to be something that will take the best of our experience over this last period of time and inject our old ways with a degree of creativity. And I really hope that we can build on that in a non-crisis situation and keep that focus on how do we create a better society, a better approach to public services, a better approach to life.